morning shows to get advertisers all excited. And there's a lot that got us excited, too. Scream Queens is dope. Definitely dope. It's like Scream meets Mean Girls. You're going to like it. Trust me. It's very, you know, Heather's meets Halloween. And I was instantly just obsessed. I mean, a lot of girls on the cast, a lot of amazing fashion. Everybody's dying to know what producer Ryan Murphy has got planned. And aside from Scream Queens, we got secrets from the cast from American Crime Story, The People vs. O.J. Simpson. Selma Blair is Kris Kardashian. She has a great occasion to be dramatic and show a sympathetic, dramatic side to Kris Jenner that, you know, I wanted to tell. I was also lucky enough to speak to Kris Jenner and try to get to, get to understand who Robert was. And, um, yeah. I'm really excited. So I've watched a lot of tape and seen a lot of footage, courtroom footage, everything. Well, we all know that Idol is over after next season, and Paula thinks that her departure is one of the big reasons the show's ratings have dropped. I was at the height of the most success ever. And um, I guess when, when first when I left first, and then Simon left next, the, the audience could feel that. I think, and sometimes things run its course. And nearly three weeks after the suicide of Everybody Loves Raymond star Sawyer Sweeten, his TV mom Patricia Heaton shared her grief. Uh, we were with the family, and I just watched an episode of Raymond the other night, to, and I saw in the first season when the when the twins were really young, and it was really. Tough. The People Magazine Entertainment Weekly Party was kind of a preview of many of the stars who are returning to TV. And ET Online sorted out which shows are safe and which got cut with your ultimate cheat sheet. But what about Gray's life after McDreamy and those rumors that Patrick Dempsey got cut because he clashed with producer Shonda Rhimes? The stars on her shows revealed how she keeps everybody in line. She has a no policy and it really seems to be working. Everybody gets along quite well. And we all got checked to see if we were before she cast us. And as for Scandal's big finale Thursday night, Shonda told us herself she just re-edited the ending. We were done and I sort of woke up one morning and thought, eh, no, and we went back and did something different. I hear that she's recut everything. Shonda's had a vision and changed some stuff, so I'm excited to find out just what happens Thursday night.